To some, an arid desert may be an unlikely place to build a home. After all, sand is coarse and rough and gets everywhere. But those same trackless grains are the animated golden foundation of the territory of brimstone sands. Come along and experience the unexpected delights and far more expected dangers of this remarkable province of Eternum. Enter by way of the gates in the north of Ebenscale and you'll find yourself near the dead water wastes. But don't let that name fool you. The landscape is absolutely teeming with life. From the tiny, adorable young scorplings, watch your step their acid burns, to the ferocious dead water dogs, be careful they bite, to the gigantic sandworms. Yeah, they'll eat you too. In addition to all the things that can kill you, Adventurers will also find plenty of plant life, like tall cactuses, medium cactuses, and small prickly pear cacti, which incidentally make the best margarita flavor no matter what Brewmaster uh. Beckus thinks. Speaking of beverages, if you find yourself a bit parched by the sun and sands, there are a few places where a dehydrated traveler can find refreshment and respite from the elements. The largest of which is the town of New Corsica. This oasis is centrally located within the territory and boasts lush greenery and expansive Roman villas available for purchase. Mosaics and frescoes adorn the architecture, both inside and out, and the open streets afford passers-by an excellent view of the Great Pyramid of Arquette, which rumor has it holds ancient treasures within. Unfortunately, the stately arena of New Corsica has been closed by order of the Pontifex, but one can always enjoy the splendid outdoor theater, a wonderful place to practice your favorite monologues, play a jaunty tune with friends, or chat with an ancient Egyptian architect slash pharaoh slash desert sage. For intrepid explorers fascinated by the ruins and mysteries of the past, head north from New Corsica and try your hand at the puzzles left behind in the derelict outposts of Hermopolis to find your way to the tomb below. Or perhaps venture further to the flourishing oasis of Spontanea to fill your flask with Azoth water while enjoying the vestiges of the ancient buildings around you. But keep a wary eye open as someone or something has been inexplicably constructing additional pylons in the midst of its bountiful greenery. And danger could be lurking behind every leafy palm. Brimstone Sands is not for the faint of heart, but for those adventurers mighty enough to brave the centurions and menacing sphinxes amid the sun-parched dunes, the treasures to be found are beyond measure.